Well, hello everybody. We uh, we got a load here of wood. We got a call from the mill. The trailers, the trains got to go out today, so they said you you've got to get down here by 18:30, or the train's gone. Or was it 1800? It was one or the other. 1830, 1800. <clears throat> so we're going to assume 1800. We're going to head down there now. Uh, this is probably going to be the last load we gonna, we're going to be able to take. So I've, I've piled it as high as I could. <clears throat> I was using the, uh, the front loader as well as the, the crane here <clears throat> to, uh, to try to load it all up as high as I could. As, as high as I risked, let's put it that way. <clears throat> oh boy. There we go. <clears throat> then, once we do this, we're, we'll kind of <clears throat> look at our finances a bit. <clears throat> <clears throat> we'll look at our finances a bit and uh, cultivate. <clears throat> I think that's what we're, we're going to need to do is do a little bit of cultivating, a little bit of seeding. <clears throat> haven't bought a fertilizer unit yet, so we we'll probably got to do that. And then, <clears throat> if we can find the money, we might be able to uh, <clears throat> swing a strong enough tractor for the um, chipper. If we can do that, then we'll chip up what we got left. <clears throat> All right, here we go, coming into the mill. <clears throat> Hopefully, hopefully we'll have the money we need for what we need to do. The guys at the mill say that that I'll make a good bit of money on what they, what I brought in because you know it's it's mainly oak. <clears throat> There's a little bit of maple and ash mixed in, but overall they they were really happy with what I brought in. Even the gnarled stuff that I I didn't think was going to do very well said they could still make something out of it so. And one piece decides. I think it's one piece. Yep, one piece says, oh, I don't want to work. All right. There we go. Perfect. <clears throat> All right. <clears throat> there we go. Send that off. See what happens. <clears throat> So we should uh, we should make a little bit of money. We'll probably come back with a big old load of <clears throat> the beautiful smooth wood that you can use for for <clears throat> building like furniture, really nice stuff. And then they're probably going to bring back a bunch of the the stuff that you kind of rough cut and you use it for random other things oh my <clears throat> um well hello money I was not expecting you all right well uh yeah huh um, well, I think we're going to go cultivate because, because, well, I got to tell the missus how much we just made on that delivery. Um, so I think we'll, we'll, uh, we'll go and cultivate, uh, to kind of calm down because my heart's going like pitter pat, I tell you. Um, I could pay off the loan. I could pay off the loan. Then I wouldn't be indebted to the bank. The bank couldn't say jump. Or they could say jump, and I could tell them to go, you know, jump off a bridge. <sighs> but I could get the tractor that we need to chip. Huh. 
Huh. Wow. That would that might be a good idea. Well, hmm. That's gonna be a tough one. Alright, we're gonna go cultivate so we can calm down. Yeah, I think we'll do that first. Then we'll make a decision from there. Alright, I had to I had to go run over to the orange tractor, pick up the uh pick up the weight, because Whoa. Even with the weight, we're kind of uh kind of at the ragged edge of what this tractor can take. I don't know, that makes me wonder. That makes me think a little bit. Now would it be wise to maybe sell this little tractor and bring in a big tractor? Hmm. That could be the wise move. Yeah, that could be that could be the smart thing to do. Cause this tractor isn't gonna be able to haul a heck of a lot. Going sideways, mind you. Whoa, we're like we're we're drifting. We are drifting a tractor. It's a good thing I learned how to drive in the, the derbies there. Learning how to Slide your vehicle around. We, uh, yeah. Good. Yeah, I'm wondering if, if this tractor shouldn't be, uh, be on the block to, to go. Be the economical thing to do, I think. But do I really need, do I really need three tractors? Now we got the the styer that handles a lot of the woodworking. Woodworking? No. Tree cutting. <clears throat> well, woodworking we're gonna set up. We, we're gonna have to set up woodworking shed. Spend some time with some of this wood, you know, plane it down nice and smooth. Maybe make some toys out of it. Oh, that would be that'd be wonderful. We make some toys. Take them to the kids in town. Ooh, that would be that would be really nice. Take it to the church. Yeah, give it to the kids that, that maybe can't maybe you know, their parents can't afford some new toys, but some handmade toys. That that might just do the you know, fit the bill for them. But that, that that's something different. That's something different. So Sell this tractor. Have fund us a little bit of money back. And then pick up one of the more powerful tractors so that we could uh, use the chipper. That just that just might might fit the bill. I'm trying to think how this thing's gonna handle the cedar as well. I don't know if it's gonna handle it very well. I mean I bought it because I kinda liked it. You know that, that feel of an old tractor, but I was never really one for older equipment. <clears throat> I like I liked I liked the tech of the new stuff. You know, where a lot of people might, you know, think about old cars and stuff. I was eh, cars are nice, but I don't know. Something about that destruction derby made me think of what the use of an old car was. Maybe we finish up this field with this. Drop the cultivator back off in the shed. And then run this, run this down to the shop. We have to pick up a fertilizer spreader. Yeah, 
Yeah, we gotta we gotta pick up the fertilizer spreader, so we have to think about that money too. Of course, we have to have money for seed. Though I I think I think we might have the money no matter what. Just I'm just thinking out loud here. Yeah, let me finish this. Let me think about it. I'll sit here in the tractor while I'm driving. I'll think about what we're going to buy. Well, here we are finishing up the uh, cultivating. Except for that spot I missed because the tractor started pulling too hard. Let's go get that. And I've come to a few decisions. <clears throat> One, this tractor, this tractor just doesn't have the oomph that we need here on the farm. No fault of the tractor, of course, more of a fault of myself for not thinking when I bought it. So, definitely gonna have to get rid of this tractor and get another one. <clears throat> the other thing I kind of thought about as I was looking at the land here is it looks like a large part of this land is all still very rich from having that grass the sod broken over it. So I don't think I'm going to need the fertilizer right off the bat. I think we'll be able to get away without. At least initially. <clears throat> oh, I'm going to destroy my plow doing that. All right, lower that down. <clears throat> now, I was going to say, oh, let's go ahead and just seed this this area, and then we'll we'll go get the new tractor, but I thought about it. Well, this, this tractor's going to struggle with the seeder. That seeder is pretty darn big. So we're just going to go ahead and run down to the shop. I think we'll trade in this guy. Been a, been a good little workhorse, but not, not strong enough for what we need. Now, the... The styre we have, I think we're going to be keeping that for quite a while. It's a good basic workhorse, I think. But when it comes down to it, <clears throat> we need we need a few more horses. A few more horses. And I think trading this in, we can look at a few other things that we got that they got here at the, the shop and and see what, what else we might want to add to the farm. Alright, let's uh let's sell this. Alright. So that's gone. It's a good workhorse, but let's uh let's replace it with something better. Okay, so I'm thinking we're going to go with this 7250 TTV Black Edition because I like that color. I like the coloration of it. So we're going to go ahead and buy that. And that leaves us with 102000 And fertilizer is only fourteen. dollars ah. Now... Gotta kind of think. 102,000. Well, we were gonna buy Mr. Scratch's a few friends. Ah, oh, but how many? We're gonna buy Mr. Scratch's 50 friends or 100 friends? I can't remember. I can't remember. I'll think about that. I, I, I don't remember. Uh, all right, so what else? You know what? Let's just go ahead and get the fertilizer. Right. <clears throat> okay, so we've got that. Now, let's run over here. Kick a little bit of more of our loan to the curb. Uh, there. Okay. There. So, I kick a little bit more of our loan to the curb. Because we don't want the bank to get involved in anything. Oh, wow. Uh, there's going to be a learning curve involved in this, I'll tell you what. Boy, howdy.
All right. <clears throat> this is a pretty looking machine. Pretty looking machine. Right, let's, let's, well, I'm thinking about it. Well, it's nice and clean and fresh. Oh, look at that. She's a beaut. Ooh, boy, I, I didn't think I was going to have something like this right right off the bat. I thought I was going to be <clears throat> running with that equipment I bought for, I don't know, years. Here we are already. Oh, look at her. She just climbs this hill like it's not even here. Oh, that's a beautiful thing. All right, so the first thing we're going to do, I think, is we need to just go ahead and seed. Think. Or should we chip? Seed or chip? Seed or chip? Hmm. I'm not going to fertilize this first run. The land looks a little bit too rich for me. Right on the breaking of the grass like that. So we're going to go ahead and put this up. Seed or chip. Um. Well, let let's see. Let's see. I think that's that's a good uh, good starting point. Let's take this. I know I probably don't need this front weight at all, <clears throat> but I do need to take it back to the styre because I've been running it on the back of the styre. It won't hurt nothing to have it on here. Go. All right, now let's go put some seed in here. We're gonna go with wheat. It's our seed of choice. All right, there we go. Ooh, seed is expensive. Boy, howdy. There we go. <clears throat> All right, so we'll go seed up this field. Then we'll uh, see what other other kinds of trouble we can get into. We do have a bunch of stuff to chip. All right, let's stop here. So lower. Turn it on. Let's go. She still does pull a little bit, but not nearly as much as that other one did. Now we got a lot more traction here. Oh yeah, good stuff. We are farming. We are finally farming. Instead of just being lumberjacks. I don't mind being a lumberjack, mind you. <laughs> nice to be a farmer as well. That should be done. I'm making a lot of guesses about where the back of this thing is, but so far I've been okay. All right. Now I do think I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to do something about my tractors get and my equipment getting all dirty, but we'll deal with that when the time comes. And that time is not right now because way too much other things we need to concentrate on, I think. Maybe on a rainy day or something, we'll take care of it. I don't know. <clears throat> we'll see. All right, so I got this field to do. Once I get the field done, I think we'll look at the chipper and see what we can do about that. So we'll work on this field really quick.
Well, we're all done seeding, which is, well, it feels so good. It feels so good to finally have some seeds in the ground. I mean, we, we spent so much time and effort to, uh, to break ground, to clean out the trees, all of that. It feels so good to finally have some seeds in the ground. that okay <clears throat> so now now let's go get the chipper and go up to the stole the stole no the stire can't even remember my tractors now and let's um we got to give him the front weight and he needs to go get the, uh... Oh, boy. Hold on. There we go. Then he needs to go get the, um... The other trailer. Yeah, he needs to go get the other trailer, the, um... To put the chips in. <clears throat> and then we just gotta... Load her up start making ourselves some wood chips. Whoa. Driving a little bit erratic. A little bit erratic. All right, where are we going to start? I guess we'll, we'll start with the pile of... <clears throat> the pile of larger wood over here. Let's go to the front way, drop that. Back up so he can get it. Now I think <clears throat> what we'll do is we'll position the um, position the trailer appropriately, and then we'll. Uh, <clears throat> now why'd I do that? Why did we get the trailer? Did I do that? Uh, I don't know. Okay, let's let's drop it off there then, because made a mistake. Let's go get the trailer. <clears throat> um, we'll position the trailer, then we'll put the weight back on the back. Cause then the then the uh, the styre can pick up the. Uh, All the stuff we're trying to pick up. Okay. Here we go. All right. <clears throat> let's go. Uh, let's go see what we can see. So I think we can position this right back here somewhere. Position it here. Because we can we can use the other tractor to position um, the chipper properly. Oh my goodness, so much equipment just to break ground. Alright. So let's park that there. So let's start by putting the pipe out so we can get an idea of where we need to position. Okay, that's okay. Good. So let's pull forward to right about there. <clears throat> okay. Think we're in position now. Let's, uh, See what we can do about getting this thing running, huh? Um, let's turn it on. All right, so it's running. I just need to get ourselves something to drop in there. 
see about making some some capital with wood chips. Let's grab this thing. Now rotate. Can you, can you go in there? It'd be really great if you could. Um, uh, close, trees in the way. All right. Wow. Let's try it from here then. That's falling off my chipper. That's not getting into my chipper. <clears throat> okay, let's try it with, let's try it with small log. Let's, let's not be crazy, Hans. Let's, let's start with something that's a little bit more manageable and then we can work our way up to that. That's what your mama always taught you. Whoopsie. Um, she always taught, don't just jump right into the biggest, baddest thing you got. Learn, boy. <laughs> okay. Rotate. Back. There we go. Now. Still don't, still don't want it completely. There we go. No. Come on, in you go. You're annoying. Okay. Uh, jeez. <laughs> uh, and then rotate it in. That's one way to do it. All right. So we got that one. Let's see what we can do about this thing over here. I think I, I think I understand what I'm supposed to be doing. Try it with this. Does that look lined up? I can't even tell. Sure, it's lined up. Let's go with that. I don't know what it's doing. Oh my gosh, you can't see. Okay, I see I see the problem now. Uh go. Go up. Out, down. Come on, chipper. Come on, eat it. Nom, nom, nom. Wait, maybe, maybe. This way. Try it. Come on. Come on. You want to go in there? No? Why not? You seem to be in there. Are you, are you? Too big to handle. Is that the... 
Come on. No? Hmm. This is going to be a problem. You, you want to go in there? Wait, maybe if I... <clears throat> maybe if I, I give it a hit from the back. That's not hitting it in the back. That's that's completely missing the target. That's, that's closer to hitting it. Wow. Okay. All right. So we're going to need the other trailer over here to load up some of these logs. That's what it gets down to. So I'm going to have to go get the other trailer with the styre. So I'm basically going to need four pieces of equipment to do anything. That's good. That's good. Okay. Well, at least we know what we're doing now, sort of. Kind of. Maybe. Alright. So we'll, uh, we'll work on this problem. I'll work on this and, and, and we should we should be able to to finish cleaning everything up, I think. See any reason why not. I'm thinking though I probably need another tractor. Ah. Oh, probably you probably would have been wise to keep the other tractor, but Oh well. I know I could go get it, but I'd have to take out a loan to do that, and I don't want to go back to a loan. So what I'm thinking here, I put that weight in a really bad spot, is one thing I'm thinking. But if I put this right here, oh wait, hold on, drop those. Put that over here, like so. Now, whatever can't be chipped can be easily dropped over on the other trailer for hauling out later. Yeah, that'll be, that. that's called problem solving right there. That's called problem solving. So now I just get in here. Uh, let's see if I can like that. Nope, not like there. I got it. Pick it up. Because it won't work in there. Should. Be able to move it around. Let's duck that out of the way really quick. Right around. And ah, uh, that was close. We almost got it. And then clamp it and miss. Okay. <clears throat> I have to get farther back. Right there. Got it. All right. Ah. Oh. This is going to be a problem, I see. Why is this a problem? Am I not clamped on there? Oh, no, I am. Nope, I'm not. Why not? I don't know. Okay, 
that's closed claw, that's open claw. Open, down, close. Okay. Real. Okay, so really carefully means diddly. That's an interesting, um, it's interesting. Closer, down, like that, just straight up, and finally, there, <laughs> we succeeded, we have succeeded, so then what we'll do is I'll use the, um, the styre here, and I'll push stuff close to the, the big, the, the big, uh, TTV, and then the stuff that can be ground up will be ground up, the stuff that can't we'll put in the other machine to take over and get rid of that, and we'll have this all cleared up, I hope. I certainly hope. I'm getting tired of looking at it. It's looking terrible. I want, I want this place to look nice, you know? The, the grandkids are coming, and, you know, I don't want them to be playing around and hurt themselves or anything like that, so. We gotta, we gotta clean this place up. Oh, I can almost put that into there, but not quite. Huh. Well, what do you know? Drop it off right there. Yeah. All right, well, until next time. Y'all be careful out there. <laughs>